Hi guys, welcome back to my channel with me Ria. Today I'm going to teach you Zero O'Clock by BTS. These are the cards that we need to know to play the intro and the verse. Feel free to skip ahead if you already know the fingering position. To play C chord, take our tiny finger and place it on the 3rd fret of our string. Next is E minor 7. Take our middle finger, place it on the 2nd fret, 3rd string. And our ring finger on 2nd fret, 1st string. Next chord is F. Take our index finger, place it on the 1st fret, 2nd string. Our middle finger goes to the 2nd fret, 4th string. Last chord is F minor. Take our index finger and put it on the 1st fret, 4th string. Our middle finger on the 1st fret, 2nd string. And our tiny finger on the 3rd fret, 1st string. F minor. To sound like the original, we need to put a capo on the 1st fret here. But in this tutorial, I'm gonna explain without capo, okay? In the intro and the first, we need to play like that. From F to F minor, it can be quite tricky at first, so let's practice that first before we continue, okay? Make sure we can do it smoothly. Now, let's play the intro and the verse with lyrics, okay? Until there, okay? For new chords that we need to know to play the pre-chorus, feel free to skip ahead if you already know the fingering position. To play D minor, take our index finger and place it on the 1st fret, 2nd string. Our middle finger goes to the 2nd fret, 4th string. And our ring finger just below the middle finger. Next chord is G. Our middle finger goes to the 2nd fret, 1st string. Our index finger goes to the 2nd fret 2, but on 3rd string. And our ring finger on the 3rd fret, 2nd string. And then we go E7. Our index finger goes to the 1st fret, 4th string. Our middle finger goes to the 2nd fret, 3rd string. And our ring finger on the 2nd fret, 1st string. I love this chord, it sounds so good. And then we go A minor. So just middle finger and place it on the 2nd fret, 4th string. So in the pre-chorus, it goes like this. I'm gonna play with the lyrics slowly. <laughs> The chord progression in the chorus is the same like in the intro and the first, but we need to strum it like this. It might be a little bit hard if we play this pattern while singing the chorus. So if you have trouble in playing this pattern while singing, you can just play the pattern in which I'm going to explain later in the post-chorus, okay? But now I'm going to sing this with the lyrics first, okay? Then we enter the post chorus. In the post chorus, it's the same, but the strumming pattern becomes this down, down, up, up, down. So just 
just now, if you didn't want to play the pattern in the chorus, we can just play with this. It's the same. You see? It sounds good either way, so you can pick from one of those, yeah? So let's play the post chorus now. Zero o'clock The strumming pattern in the second verse is the combination between the first first strumming pattern and the post chorus strumming pattern. So in Jimin's part, we're going to do one, two, three, four, like how we played the first verse, four, okay? But on Young's part, we're going to do like how we played the post chorus. Okay, so let's go with the lyrics. 조금씩 박자감이 그러죠 쉬운 표정이 안 지어져 익숙한 가사 자고 잊어 내맘 같은 게뭐 하나 없어 그랬다 지나간 일들이야 혼자 말해도 참 쉽지 않아 Is it my fault? Is it my problem? 답이 없는 나의 매아리만 집에 와 We're going to repeat the pre-chorus chorus and the post chorus again okay so i'm just going to skip to the bridge we have two new chords in the bridge the first one is d chord take our middle ring and tiny finger place them all on the second fret of fourth third and second strings okay. and then last chord is g minor take our index finger place it on the first fret first string our middle finger goes to the second fret third string and our ring finger on the third fret second string we just need to strum once each chord in a bridge. After the bridge, we're going straight directly to the last chorus. It's the same like the previous chorus, just with different lyrics. So let's play along. Two son moa, kiddo hane, day dan chum, toad kiddo for me, chum that kiddo for me, e no nega, kachina myon, se no nega, shijak tweri. So that's the end of today's tutorial. I hope you're gonna find this tutorial useful. If you do, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I'm gonna be so thankful to you. Thank you so much for watching and see you next time.